Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vittori Vita and you are watching Vittori Vita TV. Okay, so hi guys. I know it's raining today and my bangs are all over the place. It seems to have a life of its own, but I'm here discovering new things for all of you. I know you guys must be wondering where I'm at. I'm actually here to share with you a new place, a new restaurant, a new tap room. It hasn't been featured on my channel before, so I'm super duper excited. Let's go, let's get inside. Bay for the night. You could be, you could be, you could be, you could be. Bay for the night. Bay for the night. You could be, you could be, you could be, you could be. You could be bay for the night. You could be bay for the night. You could be bay for the night. I pay for the weed. I pay for the wine. I pay for the slide. Still rocking gold chains like a gold bay. Bath and break them do a cocaine. Okay, so we're inside Pile of Bones tap room and Malinche is actually inside Pile of Bones and so I have heard about them but why don't we find out what Pile of Bones is all about? So we have here Stacy. Hello. Say hi to Stacy. How's it going? Stacy, tell us about Pile of Bones and what does it offer to the public? Okay, so Pile of Bones, the brewery, was started by a couple of guys who just really love making beer. Oh. And then it was a hobby just for fun. And then they thought, you know, we can make a business out of this maybe. Yes. And their beer has become really popular all over the province. So they decided to open this tap room and showcase different different beer especially from Saskatchewan. We have eight or nine different breweries from all over the province. Everything is made in the province and the beer is always changing. So there's something for everyone. Even if you're not a beer lover, we have some cider and some kombucha on tap I as well. I think that's me. I love something that tastes sweeter because I feel that beer might be a little too bitter. So sure, it's sure, good yeah. to know that I have that option to Absolutely. get a cider. Definitely. Okay, Definitely. yeah. And even a wide variety of beers. Some of them are very seasonal. We have very some sour beers, some fruity beers right now. Something okay. for everyone, I like to think, you know? And yeah. It's, it's different every day. Like every day there's something new on tap. So. Okay, that's awesome. I'm very excited. Well, I'm trying out the cider today, and yeah. I. And what do you think so far? I haven't tasted it yet, so I'm gonna go give it a try. Okay, you should, okay. definitely. Thank you so much, Tacy. It's that love supreme, like on train. You could be bay for the night. You could be bay for the night. There's actually another establishment inside Pile of Bones, and that is Malinche. Okay, just say hi to Conley and Mariana. Hi. <laughs> Mariana and Conley are with Malinche. I've been meaning to ask you what Malinche means. So we'll have Mariana answer some of her questions. We'll have a little talk and we'll have a lot of food. <gasps> I am excited. I haven't eaten for the day, so I'd probably be eating lots today. <laughs> but what a good way it is to feast on food that on a rainy day like today, right? What do we have here? Chicharron. Chicharron. Yeah, chicharron. And a variety of salsa. What do you call it? Okay, so chi this is chicharron and four different salsa. Why don't I give it a taste first? I'm super excited. I can't even control myself. Do a little dip. We also, actually in the Philippines, we also have a chicharron. Oh yeah, this is a wheat chicharron. So this is wheat chicharron. But usually there's, there's pork, beef, yes. chicken, you can make But this is unique. This is something I have not tried. Wheat chicharron is something new to my taste. So let's give it a try. <laughs> this is something different. It's a snack you want to have with your beer. Yes. Oh my gosh, I have found love at Malinche. <laughs> this is, okay, so this is even just for starters, guys. I'm happy. I could just like stop doing my video and start eating right now, but I'm not gonna do that because I'm committed to you. <laughs> so let's ask Mariana about Malinche. Mariana, what 
does Malinche mean? Uh, Malinche is the name of a Mexican urban legend that was an Aztec woman that fell in love with a main conqueror that came to Mexico. Not only fell in love, but gave him a son. Um, it's a very controversial character. Malinche in Regina is Mexican food with prairie ingredients. So we're bridging two places. I love that already. Mexican food is about fresh ingredients. We just had a try at the wheat chicharron and that was already so good. I'm sure you'll love it here. I would love you to come and give it a try. Support local. Hashtag buy local and support local. Conley is bringing another item here. So what do we have here? Here we have, uh, it's not actually in the menu, but these are vegan tacos. So, vegan tacos, yeah. okay. It's kind of like on the secret menu right now at Calabone. And I'd love to show you like more of how to eat a taco. I grew up in Tijuana. I was born in Mexico City, which you love. I have such a mix. So very important to have salsa. So we have the main things. A lot of times in our tacos in Mexico, there are different styles of serving it. Here we serve what it's called like imposed taco. So it has its beans, it has, it's like a really nutritious, very delicious food, and it has its garnish. So with that, you play with freshness, acidity, flavor. And then we have three different salsas and one chipotle crema. So these are like our sides right now at the brewery. Salsa verde, salsa cruda, chipotle, salsa matcha. Salsa matcha is the spicy is one of all of them. My favorite is the salsa verde right now, which is also tomatillos from our garden. And he did your garden, so it's like a mix. So I put my salsa, and then I like the matcha, just to add a little bit of spice. Like, you don't want to do a lot of it, because it's spicy. Mm -hmm. And then, basically, whoop, that's it. Then you grab the tortilla, you fold it, Okay. And then you bite it. You bite it. Oh, there you go. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. That looks so tasty already. I'm like envying Mariana right now. Something vegan and something so tasty. I'm totally down for that. It's my turn to give it a try. Mariana, this is so good. That's awesome. It's an effort of love and collaboration. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am happy. Mm -hmm. Like I found my happy place. Mm -hmm. It would be minus 40 outside mm -hmm. and I would still come here <laughs> and enjoy your food. Okay, so that's our quesadilla. Yes, it's a wheat tortilla, handmade tortilla, uh, has two, a mix of two flours. A white one from RJ Milling and a, and a stone ground from Daybreak Mill. One from Esteban, one from uh, outside of Regina. And then when you open your quesadilla, take a look. Oh. So this is the picadillo quesadilla. It has some like uh, pickled carrots, some uh, avocado, cilantro, and onion, and your beans. Wow. Okay, I'm super excited. I'm gonna give this a try right away. <laughs> These models and these bottles got me drunk in. Girl, I like the way that you rock, the way that you dance, the way that you drop. Wanna get you out of this club, and into the car, and back to my spot. So good. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's just so full of flavor. Cheers to that. Thank you, Pile of Bones and Malinche. It's so good. I'ma get you home, we can sip all night. Like a bowl this weed, I'ma treat you right. Baby, we could go all night. I am also excited to try the dessert. So the dessert is, what is this Conley? So this is a pineapple upside down cake. Pineapple upside down cake? I'm ready for you. Conley, how do you stay fit with all this food around you? I eat so many tacos every day. 
Oh my gosh, you're living your best life. This is not even something really new because like a lot of big chain restaurants already offer like tacos and quesadillas. Yeah. But what we have here is like a more local, more organic option. And I'm all about that. And it's authentic. And it's authentic. The best part about it. If you're looking for Malinche, I'll put the address here. Okay. So this is where you can find Malinche. It's actually inside Pile of Bones Tap Room or Brew Room. More things that you like. I'ma kiss your neck, I'ma pull your hair. Well, you could be, you could be, you could be, you could be. I'm in my Uber right now. I had a super, super duper delicious supper at Malinche and I had a really good cider, pineapple cider at Pile of Bones. So yeah, I just hope that you get to give it a try. If you give it a try, you won't regret it. It's so good. And you're also supporting like local, most of the ingredients that they have, if not all, are all from local suppliers. And so that's really awesome to know. So hashtag support local. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to follow me on my social media channels. I am on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, and Facebook. Just look for Vittori Vita. Keep on watching Vittori Vita TV because when it's fun, it's Vittori Vita. Pay for the night. Pay for the night. You could be, you could be, you could be, you could be. You could be